Hello everyone, welcome to my first Python tutorial in quite a long time. And in this one, I'm just trying to get back into the groove of being able to write Python programs. So I thought of a kind of nice and easy project I could do, where I check if a word is an isogram or not. And uh, the definition of an isogram, I guess I should write it right here. Uh, isogram is a word that contains uh, only unique letters. So basically, for example, the word isogram is a isogram because uh, each letter only appears once. So uh, if you think about it, that is true. But how do we check for that? Well, let's see. We can set up a set of characters and then for every letter we um, we have we can insert uh, each letter in the word into the set and if uh, the length of the set after an insertion is less than uh, the amount that we've put in so far then that means uh, it's not an isogram and we can basically break the loop and then output the answer to either yes or no. Alright so how do we do that? Well let's see we can get an input word first so like word equals input um, wait there's no there's no semicolon okay this is my first slip up and I, I like using like single quotes actually uh, instead of double quotes what is your word wait alright let's do it like that so we ask what is your word and then now we can do a for loop for no there's no there's no uh, parentheses in Python. Okay, 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 okay. Um, for yeah, wait for i n in enumerate word. Wait, okay, it's a it's a colon. All right. Is this how you do it? Wait, let me just like print um. I and then hold on this is so annoying wait print a space holy smokes I am bad okay oh my god I'm typing semicolon after semicolon oh. backslash n okay let's just print out I and n because I forgot what enumerate actually does like what what order the um, the number is and what order the actual value is so just check uh, word all right what's happening here um, zero w one oh. okay so I is the actual um, iterator and then is iterator even the right word it's like the number and then um, w is going to or n is the uh, the letter within the word so now we know just write a comment here i is the number n is just do like c instead of n whoops c is the character all right so uh, well we can do an if statement wait no we can have a set here so um, set of car or set car equals uh, set and we can leave it like that I'm pretty sure wait there's no semicolon okay okay can I stop typing semicolons like what is wrong with me just like stop okay no more semicolons I mean semicolons are nice and all but it is not used here all right set car dot Insert, right? Oh, I think it is. Alright, see? If 
Okay, I remember this. If len set car is less than uh, i plus len, then so i is the number we're at. So we go from zero, but the actual length should be uh, should be one, one more than the index. All right. Uh, then we see out. No, <laughs> see out what? Okay. Oh my goodness. Print. No. All right. Um, and we can break. All right. We should do a boolean. So we can do like. Um, what is it? ISO equals, and the, the true and false is capitalized, be sure to remember that. There's no semicolon. Oh my goodness. Alright. Print? No. And we can uh, set ISO to false. No semicolon. Oh my goodness. Alright. If ISO um, then we can print Yes. Let's do a single quotes. Alright. So, this looks pretty good. Yeah. Alright, let's run it. What is your word? Word. What? Oh, wait, there's no insert. What am I supposed to do now? Hold on. If you can't insert. Huh? I thought insert was the command. Push? Oh wait, is it append? Wait, let me just try it. Okay, I think it's append. There's no append either? Huh? I oh, so that's like unalterable? Let me look this up on my phone actually, so that I don't have to search it up on uh, from the computer. All right, sets in Python. Are sets immutable? Let me see. Python set. Am I even thinking of the right type of structure though? Alright, sets are unordered. Uh, set elements are unique. Oh. Okay, interesting. How do I add something to a set though? Wait. Um, this tutorial is not telling me. Okay, operating. Um, how do I operate on a set? Um, let me just look it up. How to add elements to a set. How to add element to set in Python. Oh, it's just dot add. Okay. Well, I should have tried that. Makes a lot of sense. Alright, the answer is yes. Alright, let's try a an isogram, a non-isogram word. Alright. Uh, non-isogram word like banana. Okay. Uh, let's try another one. Mm. Let's see. We can do repeat. No. Oh okay, yeah, that's right. Uh, Piano. Oh, piano is an isogram. Okay, interesting. So, that's about it for this video. And uh, basically, the whole thing was just to get myself a bit warmed up with Python so that I don't write like garbage if I ever have to write in Python. Which I definitely will. Because I do really like Python. I'm just like using C a lot more now because. I'm doing Yusuko logs every day. Uh, but anyway, uh, the next video will be 
about my processing uh, project about paint splats so watch out for that and that was this video about isogram checkers so thank you guys for watching and see you guys next time